a beautiful Monday and we have worked all weekend so we decided to go on a little adventure and uh, head to Hibbley Hot Dogs in West Virginia. We have watched the uh, TV show. What's the TV show? No, they're just driving to that. Yes, and it was on a couple other ones but we have never been and we've always talked about it and wanted to check it out so it's going to be 84, sunny, beautiful so we are going to go and check it out. I just got his Elvis do on the day. I have the window down. <laughs> Anybody who knows Louisa or familiar with that area knows the dome. The dome. So I think I'm gonna get me some lemonade. I'm getting water. <laughs> we made it. We're not sure what's going on. We're a little confused. I think we got confused because there was a truck parked there and we couldn't really park in the parking lot, so we had to turn around and come back. But uh, it's also confusing. We're not sure where to go in. But we'll figure it out. I don't know if you can hear me over this big truck, but it looks like, I mean, they've really done up the whole hillbilly theme. So we found the entrance. Come on in here. It looks like they've got meetings on the outside. Wait for Tiny to finish texting. So we're getting our menus and we're going to go back up there and order after we figure out what we want. We have no idea. We're sitting outside because it's a beautiful day and uh, when we got here there was only like a couple people here but it's getting busy. The line was out to the door and was ordering. I'm excited. I'm ready for some hot dogs. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. It's you don't. There's no directions, so you don't know what to do no. as a first timer. We're noobs right now, so. All right, but I don't think it matters. I think it's pretty laid back, so it's yeah. not like they're going to judge you if you order wrong. <laughs> right, and probably half the people in there were like coming specifically. They're like not locals. Did you no. notice that? Yeah. They were like saw it on TV or something and wanted to drop by and yeah. check it out. Yeah. A lot of people. Yeah, there was like maybe a couple regulars, but. Uh, Everybody else was with cameras and taking pictures and filming like I am. Uh, and if you tip uh, the lady at the front, then she has to sing a song. So that's pretty cool. So there it is. I guess that's the corn dog. We ordered the corn dog. That looks like homemade. Don't look homemade, no. We was hoping it was a homemade, homemade corn dog, but I don't think it is. What are these? Uh, mac and cheese bites. Mac wedges. Those kind of look homemade. Yeah, they kind of do. And I mean, they could still be. Is this mine? Yeah, I didn't get slaw on any of mine. So what, that's the thundering herd. That's yeah. The thundering herd. And I got. Oh, jalapenos. Jalapenos. Oh man. I got a um, a hound dog and a. What's the hound dog? It has chili and onions mustard and then and barbecue sauce barbecue sauce and this was what was the name of this one this is just the, the, just the hillbilly dog we got a deep fried weenie with chili onions and mustard this slaw looks good on yours okay let's try it so what'd you think i liked it i really liked it i really really liked it <laughs> How about let's go get a cup of coffee? Yes, I'm ready for some Starbucks. But I can't wait to come back because I want to try the burger 
and I want to try some other of the hot dogs. But I'm too full now. <laughs> right. But there's some other things I want to try. But the barbecue burger, I mean barbecue hot dog, was really, really good. Right. And it was kind of like, you know, you see the, the Fieri talk about everything, so you, it was kind of hyped a little too much for me. Because really it's just regular hot dogs. But they're really good hot dogs. Yeah, they're, the they're not like super sized or right. crazy. Yeah, they're just regular hot dogs. But the hot dog, everything is fresh. The coleslaw is homemade. Everything's homemade. The chili pretty well. sauce was really good. And yeah, and and it's very affordable. Only a couple dollars yeah. for each each hot dog. So yeah. that's cool. the The corn dog had two knocks against it. One, it wasn't homemade, which it was really good, but. It was cold when we got it. Yeah. It was like ice cold. But they redid it. For yeah, us. they redid it and brought it back out and apologized. But, um, but that's just a normal thing for restaurants. Yeah. So. But I, as you can see, it, did, it didn't slow us down <laughs> at all. So. Yes, we ate every single bag. All right, let's but get right coffee. So this is our sugar shack. This is their ice cream dessert milkshake. You can get banana splits and floats. That's pretty cool. They have some cute little sitting areas. There's a table over there, a little bench. You can get your picture taken in front of the American flag. I'm not sure how to feel about this, but I have one of those Santa Clauses that I put on my front porch every Christmas. <laughs> Does that make me a hillbilly? Yes, there's a man on top of a tree. All right, no stop or no trip. We're adventures complete without the Starbucks coffee. Yay. Sometimes I get the impression that Tony gets tired of waiting on me. So what's your thoughts on the s'mores tart? It's awesome. I mean, it's really good. Gooey. Yeah. yeah. I had a bite. I concur. My cookie's good too. It's the Google car. It's the Bing car. It's the Bing one. <laughs> you should follow him. Can you imagine his his job is to drive on every street? Every street. But I mean that's all he has to do. Yeah. Just don't miss a street. 